1 by using 110 square box. First, draw the 110 square box. Then, fill in the number inside the square box. Fill in number 0 up to 10 in the first row. Number 10 up to 20 in the second row. Number 20 up to 30 in the third row. And the process continues until number 100. Then, draw the line between number 4 and 5 as shown. The left area, known as A area, draw the arrow as a reference of the direction while the left area known as B area and the arrow as a reference of the direction. Let's try example 1. Round off number 43 to the nearest 10. First, find number 43 inside the square box and circle it. Number 43 is in a area. Now look at the direction of the arrow. Draw the arrow. So as the arrow is point to number 40, so we choose 40 as the answer. So the answer is 40. Now example 2. Round off number 77 to the nearest 10. Find number 77 inside the box and circle it. So number 77 is in B area. Look at the error directions. Draw the error. As it point to number 80, so the answer is... 80. Now example 3. Round of number 85 to the nearest 10. Find number 85 inside the box and circle it. So number 85 is in B area. So look at the error. Draw the error. As the error is point to number 90, so the answer is 90. Method 2. By using number line. Let's round off number 43 to the nearest 10. Step 1. Draw the number line. Step 2. Fill in the number 40 up to 50 as we want to round off number 43 to the nearest 10. Step 4. Find the number 43 and circle it. From number 43, count how many steps that we need to reach number 50. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. It's 7 steps. Now, from number 43, count how many steps that we need to reach number 40. 1, 2, 3. It's 3 steps. Now, compare which is nearest. In this case, number 40 is nearest as we only take three steps to reach it. Therefore, the answer is 40. Now, let's round off number 85 to the nearest 10. Draw the number line. Fill in the number 80 up to 90. As we want to round off number 85 to the nearest 10. Find the number 85 and circle it. From number 85, 
count how many steps that we need to reach number 90. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's 5 steps. Now, from number 85, count how many steps to reach number 80. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It's 5 steps. Compare which is nearest. So, in this case, 85 is located in the middle of 80 and 90. Therefore, we choose the largest 10 numbers as the answer. So, the answer is 90. Method 3. By using reference rounded table. Step 1. Draw the reference table as shown. Let's round it number 43 to the nearest 10. Write number 43. Draw two arrows, upside and downside. Label the upside arrow as A. Label the downside arrow as B. Number 43 is between number 40 and 50. Look at the ones number. In this case, it's number 3. So, find number 3 in the, ref in the reference rounded table. It's under table A. Therefore, we choose number pointed by error A as the answer. So, the answer is 40. Let's round it number 77 to the nearest 10. Write number 77. Draw two error. Label it with A for the upside error and B for the downside error. So number 77 is between number 70 and 80. Now look at the ones number. It's 7. So find number 7 inside the reference rounded table. So number 7 is under B. Therefore, we choose number that pointed by arrow B as the answer. Therefore, the answer is 80.